Trooper DiCicco, is that right? DiCicco, yes, sir. Trooper Fanning, Trooper Butnik, Trooper Moore, and Trooper Kutskowski. Kukowski. Tell me that again. Kukowski. Kukowski. Yes, sir. And you were bragging to all five of them that you were going through Karen Reed's cell phone about 9.45 at night. Objection. I'll allow it. Is that right? No, I wasn't bragging. Sorry. Going through um, his retarded, retarded client's phone right now. You were shown a photograph of my colleague, Mr. Unetti, correct? Yes. The copy that I was going to use. Oh, I thought I gave him that to me. Document that you were shown, copy of the same document that you were shown by Mr. Gennetti, correct? Mr. Lally. I've done that twice. Mr. Lally. Correct. Yes. I've asked this to be Mark. Okay, any objection? Yes, Your Honor. All right, I'll see you at the time. May I have that question? Yes. You? Trooper Proctor. Proctor uh, I am not Trooper Proctor. Trooper DeChico had sent you a photograph of my colleague, Mr. Unetti, correct? Yes. You see that gentleman? I do, sir. Is that the uh, photograph that you received? Yes. Is that what you referred to on direct examination with Mr. Lally uh, about receiving a photograph from Mr. Uh, of Mr. Unetti? Correct. I hate that man. I truly hate that man. <laughs> Actually, your response was, I'm going through his retarded client's phone right now, correct? Yes, after the picture, sir, yes. Who's the retarded client? Um, I was referring to Ms. Reed, again, on professional language. I'm asking who you're referring to. Ms. Reed. you got an explanation. Who was it you're referring to as retarded? Ms. Reed. Karen Reed, the woman sitting to my left. Yes, sir. The subject of your investigation as a professional, correct? Yes, sir. As an unbiased, objective investigator, the person that you were investigating, you referred to to your bosses as retarded, correct? Again, poor language on my part. Four language is one way to put it. Completely <laughs> offensive is another way to put it, right? Jackson. I've got to sustain that, Mr. Jackson. Uh, I hate that man. I truly hate that man. I hate that man. I truly hate him. Mm -hmm. Correct? Correct. Jackson. Sustained. You can ask it differently. Sure. Yeah, I feel about it now. He's sitting right there. I still don't care from him. No. I'll let it stand. <laughs> they knew I was going through location data, text messages, Google searches. But like I had mentioned earlier, I had stopped. Except Trooper Proctor. I am not Trooper Proctor. None of that really professional sounding stuff ended up in your comments to your bosses. What did you write after you talked about going through the quote, retarded client's phone? Jackson. I'll allow it. Uh, no nudes so far. No nudes so far, mm -hmm. correct? Correct. You were looking for naked photographs of Miss Reed on a Wednesday night as you sat in your office at 9.44 p.m., correct? No, not correct. Okay. You were supposed to be objectively investigating. Does your text message to your colleagues at Massachusetts State Police reflect an objective investigation of a citizen? Objection. You can get part of that question and ask it again. She's like, let's Do go. Do you believe let's that your text go. messages were reflective of an objective investigator? Objection. I'll allow that. Do you believe that, Trooper Proctor? I believe poor jokes have, in unprofessional language, have no bearing on the integrity and the facts and physical evidence of this case. It's not that they don't have any bearing on the facts and integrity. It's that they have no place in a professional investigation because it shows bias. You weren't so much as objectively investigating Karen Reed as objectifying her, correct? Objection. I'll allow that. Is that right? Rephrase the question, please. You weren't so much as objectively investigating her as objectifying her in those moments, correct? Again, Mr. Jackson, it was a poor choice of words and a joke that I should not have texted out, but... The, from the start of the investigation, we don't know what we... Mr. Unetti, didn't we? Objection. I'll allow it. Oh. He did, sir. After you received the photo, that's when you said, I'm, quote, funny, I'm going through his retarded client's phone. Is that right? Objection. All this, but not too many. Sure. Is that correct? It's on the top of page yes, 685. That's correct. And Yuri Buchanan liked that comment. Funny, I'm going through his retarded client's phone. Didn't it? I see you laughed at an image here, sir. I can't tell if he liked that comment, sir. Trooper Proctor, this is your direct chain of command. Is that right? I am not Trooper Proctor. Yuri Buchanan? Yes, sir. Um, did you believe that your conduct was a misuse of your authority and power 
as you were going through her phone on, in August of 2022? Objection. I allow it. No, I had a warrant signed by a district clerk, Stoughton district clerk, clerk, to go through Ms. Reed's phone. I don't think it was an abuse of power. I had every right to go through that phone. Did the warrant say anything about looking for news of my client? Objection. Did it no, say anything about that? No, Your Honor.